St. Francis missing a lot of layups this year. We were told by the coach they get very frustrated when they miss those gimmies. Off the dribble drive, and Cohen Glass is Alyssa Fisher. Now pulled down by Isabella Posset, the former Robert Morris star. In the paint, Lassen has a first basket for two. Krista Grava turns around in the low post, pulled in by Posset, and quickly St. Francis will run. Head of the field, lay in by Edwards is good. What a great take. Edwards does a great job running the floor, Paul, and Posset had her head up. You want to reward your players that are going to get up and down the court. Lassen up under and short, rebounded by Varga. Posset for three. Rebound kept alive by the Seahawks. About a second and a half differential on the shot clock. They don't need it as Hayward knocks down her second field goal. She's got four. Well, she's the best on the ball defender, but she's giving Coach Coburn and the Seahawks some offense in this first quarter today. Posset goes glass, just beating the shot, the, the uh, game clock. Puts on the brakes. They're defending her very tightly today, Pam. Edwards averages over eight a game. That's a three, and it falls for Dimitrievich. Trim into this seven-point deficit. That is Thibel to the baseline for Wubudu. Knocked away momentarily, but she's able to corral. Back up top. Cowan for three. Win over the Spartans. Certainly a statement game for this Terriers program. The bucket and the foul. Alex Cowan will go to the line. Pearl. Fisher, Edwards, catch and shoot, three. She has seven. Brooklyn changes the set, a different look on the inbounds. It goes to Posset, catch and shoot, got it! Hutchinson also on the floor for St. Francis. Down low, Krista Grava with the turnaround drive. She has six. Paul, that time, good start. She's usually highly efficient. We saw her miss a couple chippies in that first half. Lassen answers in the battle of 1,000-point scorers. Seibel off the double team. Krista Grava, oh, wide open down low. What a great look for Rubudu. Paul, that time, trying to go off the dribble. At the foul line, Rubudu turns around and knocks it in. She's got seven. Five seconds to shoot. Hayward works hard and converts. Seven points for the 5'7 junior. Project. We go back to the action with under five minutes left in the third quarter. Off the putback, and we get a bucket by Jalen Lee. At this point. Click on the link, right? Ball's knocked away by Posset, recovered by Jackson. Down low, swatted away by Jalen Lee. Uh, Lee, good reaction time. Looked like the Seahawks were going to get another easy basket. Used her size. Good fundamentals. Edwards runs into traffic, flings it up anyway, and converts. Picks up another foul. Tough break for the Seahawks. Terriers have a chance to capitalize. Fisher for three. And right on cue. Scratch back into this one. Knocked away and stolen. Dimitri Everidge off the deflection by Fisher. Into the forecourt, trips, gets it to Hutchinson, and she converts by Edwards. And quickly the Terriers push. Down by four, she fires the three and hits. Yeah, Edwards has been quiet this afternoon. It's a one point ball game. Krista Grava gets it to Cowan. Her three, too strong. Oh, what a putback underneath. Voodoo, big time offensive rebound for the Seahawks. Fisher for three. She has 13. Dimitri Evich looking for some help. That's the advantage of having a veteran point guard. Who she will recognize. fire the NBA three and connect. And no surprise there, Paul. First 5A junior, she got banged up a little bit in their victory at the Mount last Saturday. But this young lady has come up big in this physical ball game. Has eight points. Posits had a good effort defensively has been involved in some big action in this Terrier comeback. And St. Francis with a dramatic come from behind victory here today. They win their third in a row. They go to seven and six overall, three and two in the league.